on my travels around Sidewell today, I found John, John and Johnny Wisher, who own a Cessna 182 and a LAA permit aeroplane, the Casa Jungmann. John, you've had it for a while, I believe. Where did you find the aeroplane and how did the LAA help you in the process of bringing it from Europe? We found the aeroplane in Holland. In fact, we were in the bar at Sherman and Elmer with uh, Brown Brown and uh, we were talking about what sort of biplane to buy, Tiger Moth, Stearman, Jungmann. He said, Jungmann's the only one and there's one for sale in Holland now. So we went across Holland, had a look at it, fell in love with it, bought it. The owner brought it across for us on the Hull Ferry and we rebuilt it in our garage over about three and a half years. Couldn't possibly, of course, have done it without the LAA. It was absolutely integral. And uh, in fact, we wouldn't have brought it across had the LAA not uh, agreed that they would put it on their register. And they've been immensely helpful, I have to say. Jenny, owning the Jungmann obviously is quite a challenge, I suppose, in terms of um, maintenance, etc. Are there ready parts available, and does the LAA perhaps help you in that process? There are parts available. It's not a big problem. Well, we get them from uh, Germany mainly, we get some from Spain. There are quite a lot of uh, Jungmanns in the UK and lots of very helpful people. Uh, there's quite a sort of coordinated uh, number of owners who, who come up with, with spares when we need them. So yeah, not a big problem. And looking between, you've got two airplanes, a Cessna 182 and the Jungmann. Is there a difference when it comes to certification and looking after them in terms of paperwork or in terms of um, ease of maintenance, shall we say? Uh, there really is no comparison. The, the, the Cessna 182 is uh, a, a full C of A on, uh, run now by the wonderful EASA. Um, uh, it's uh, incredibly regulated, it's very expensive, the paperwork is horrendous. Uh, the Jungmann is uh, a joy. Uh, the LAA are, are very helpful and tr do try to keep things as simple as possible. Um, uh, the costs are therefore much, much less. The engineers are lovely, it's, it's just, there's really no comparison. Well, that's good news to hear, and obviously this makes flying around the UK, John, a lot easier. Do you take the aircraft occasionally up, up north and around the country? Uh, yes, we do indeed. Uh, we've been uh, up to Yorkshire in it. Uh, in fact, I think it's probably the furthest we've been, but we have go to various vintage uh, fly-ins and so on. Mind you, she always decides that she doesn't much like it and springs a leak of some oil or something, yeah. so you know, she really likes to be at home, but yes, we do take her around. Excellent. Well, thanks very much and uh, happy flying in the future. Thanks for a lot of your time.